look at how it started and then you got a dumbass in chat how do they think they're good so quick to defend the survivor man he really loves doing that you gonna ask me how do they think they're good this proves my whole fucking point Get the fuck out of here <laughs> how do they think they're good i know what you're thinking jay what are you going on a tangent about let me explain it we we're playing some hunters and as usual Whenever I play Hunters, I always get the very maps that I hate playing Hunters with. Which is why we've started that Jay's Hitters of the Fog series because I am so tired of maining Hunters and getting bad maps. I don't know what DVD has done, but I feel like the map rotation for certain killers is just, just horrible. Played only the other day, got nothing but indoor maps. Playing Hunters, I get groaning storehouses, fractured cow sheds, all that bad stuff. Certain maps. Just loading into it and seeing it just kills my vibe, which has an effect on my hatches. I ain't gonna catch, not an excuse. I real, that's real talk. Y'all know you go to map, be like, oh my god, bro, it's Haddonfield. You know, it just kills your vibe. So that's where we're at. I'm already frustrated. I don't feel like playing no goddamn groaning storehouse because I already knew I was gonna get this map. On top of that, I'm also playing with crossplay off. Now, I don't know if you've ever played on PC and decided to turn off crossplay, but these games get a little sweaty. You gotta realize this. When you're playing with crossplay off, you are getting those nerds that, oh my god, console players suck. Da, 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 da. You're playing those type of sweats, those nerds. They're in a four man Discord call, playing like their life depends on it. DVD is everything to them, which is why they turned off crossplay so they don't have to worry about console players. Nah, you, you know how they go. You gotta be a real sweat to disable crossplay just because you don't want no goddamn console player on your team. Now, I said all that just to let y'all know that I was already frustrated because I did not feel like playing this game. So, due to that, my hatches weren't the best, and because my hatches weren't the best, it boosted the heck out of these survivors' ego. Now, I know a lot of y'all, Jay, why do you always say that? I say that from prior experience with dealing with people like this. Now, it's not really having an ego if you flick your flashlight and all that crap mid-game. That's not having an ego because you literally got people like me who do it for fun, do it to get chased, and we don't act like a piece of crap at the end of the game because at the end of the day, it's all for fun. When you're doing that just for fun, and you're not a piece of crap to the killer when he kills you if you happen to be playing like that cuss him out or you're trash da, 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 da. that's when you're doing it because you have an ego and you actually think you're good at this game and then when a killer kills you you're hurt that's what an ego is and i meet a lot of survivors like that which is why like i said when they start acting like this i assume that they have an ego and 95 percent of the time they prove me right what you're about to see in this video is very very cocky survivors get their little ego hurt now, I was having a bad game. It was the first game of the day with Hunters, and I had to play as a Groaning Storehouse. I already told you how I felt about that. But anyways, I wasn't the best Hunters. I'll admit that. I was playing like shit. Uh, but they got super cocky due to that. They sensed that I was a little baby this game, and they were kind of having their way, getting over altruistic, getting very cocky. And their altruism ended up getting them killed. And man, just wait until the end game. All I can say is it's kind of uh, embarrassing. I don't even know if embarrassing is the word. It's just kind of, what's, what's the word? What I'm basically saying is, how are you going to sit up there in flashlight flick and all of that good stuff when I'm missing my hatches and you think you're better than me? Then when I kill you, then you're raging at the end of the game and complaining about my play style. But when I was missing hatches, you were flashlight clicking and acting like you were just so damn good. Anywho, just pay attention to these high ego survivors, man. It's all fun and games when I'm missing hatches and as soon as they die, Look at how they act at the end of the match. Typical game. Typical, typical, typical. Let me know how you feel about survivors like this in the comment section. Uh, of course, because I'm playing Hunters, they gave me Groaning Storehouse. <laughs> this is what I be talking about, bro. This is what I be talking about. This is why I'm player. Literally, I haven't played Groaning Storehouse up until I play her. Then they give me a dumb map. She's literally running to me. Why is she running to me if she doesn't think she's good? Why is she running to me? Even not, And then I hit her in. Oh my God, bro.
kidding me are you kidding me are you fucking kidding me she's so stupid bro oh my god Are you kidding me with this fucking map, bruh? Everything keeps hitting walls and shit. Fucking dead hard trash. Oh, I hate this girl now, I'm not gonna lie. It's no fun. There's no point of playing her. Every map I'm gonna get is bad for her. What is the purpose? That shit is annoying as hell. Literally every damn map now is horrible for her. All the reason why they lost is because they what you mean, why am I mad? Because I don't like playing certain maps with hunters. And then motherfucker gonna ask me, how do they think they're good? This this is why. Look at this shit. As I'm editing this video, I didn't even realize this idiot said it's all fun until I demobilize everyone. What? That's the freak. Never mind. Let me shut up.
I, I really hope you guys are reading all of this. Please, I hope you're reading all of this entitled crap. You're flicking your flashlight trying to make the killer mad. But when I kill you now, I'm making the game incredibly boring for y'all. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I can't win, so I slug is what he says. Look at how hurt their ego is, y'all. Remember in future videos when I said, oh, these guys have an ego. When I say that, I'm thinking of survivors like this. This is sad. I'm only staying in here just so y'all can see this. Yeah, I'm in the in-game chat because I'm putting this on YouTube. What are you guys profiting off of talking shit in-game? You guys are literally doing nothing but boosting your ego from this. I. Look at how it started. And then you got a dumbass in chat. How do they think they're good? So quick to defend the survivor, man. And I've seen his name before. He loved doing that. He really loves doing that. You gonna ask me, how do they think they're good? This proves my whole fucking point. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> how do they think they're good? You just saw why. 